Okay, similar um, shapes. Um, these are straight lines. Sorry, it doesn't say that it's going to be similar similar shapes, but that's kind of what we're looking at here. It looks like it's going to be similar triangles in the diagram. These are straight lines. AB is parallel to QP, and DC is parallel to RS. Um, ABC is similar to quadrilateral PQRS. Find the ratio of the length AB to the length PQ. AB to the length PQ. Well, that's going to be the same as the ratio of the lengths in these rectangles here. So we need to find where we've got an equivalent length. And the only equivalent length is we've got this 11. So we want AB to PQ. Well, and that's going to be the same as the length AD to PS. That's 11 to 27.5. But we want it in the form 1, 2. So if we divide them both by 11, we get 27.5 divided by 11 is 2.5. So 1 to 2.5. Work out the length of RQ. So RQ here, well, the equivalent length is that 5 over there. So it's 2.5 times bigger. It's just going to be 5 times 2.5, which equals 12.5. Um, Work out the length CD. Uh, well, CD is 2.5 times smaller, so 42.5. Divided by 2.5 is going to be 17. There we go. Okay, the area of this quadrilateral is 54. Work out the area of the quadrilateral PQRS. Uh, well, it's 2.5 times bigger. But that doesn't mean the area is going to be 2.5 times bigger. Uh, the area is 2.5 squared times bigger. Uh, if it had been volume, it would have been 2.5 cubed. So I type that in, and we get 337.5 centimeters squared.